focus on an entertaining game, a game that we push towards uh, the end in order to win it. And uh, um, the team really deserves a huge compliment because we could have taken it easy and saying, you know what, we are first anyway in the group and a tie is fine, but a tie is not fine with us. And uh, so the team pushed it, they grinded it until the last minute and deserved you know, that goal. Um, and a beautiful combination there and, uh, and therefore um, obviously happy, you know, first place, nine points and uh, uh, and you can see that there is a chemistry developing that is fun to watch. Hey, uh, you talked before the game back in Salt Lake City about being excited to play against a team that you could go eye to eye with. Were you disappointed with how many men Costa Rica kept on the ball? Um, I, I think it showed a lot when, when we got the lineup, you know, and uh, obviously, you know, we had the uh, previous games and, and we saw, you know, in, in Denver they played a back five already. That shows a lot of respect <laughs> for us. Uh, and as we told the players, guys, you know, they, they're making it very compact, they're, making, they're gonna sit deep, they wanna counter break us, which they had opportunities to do that, you know. They have quality players that can always hurt you in a specific moment. Um, but they're coming out of a very, very defensive-minded uh, uh, shape, so we gotta find ways. We gotta kind of play, move the ball quickly, and, 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 and wait for those moments that they might do a mistake and open up some things. You know, and and it's, it ends up in a, in a long, long work, you know. So it's good that they have now you know, five days you know, until Sunday to recover um, uh, from that game, but it was worth it to put the extra... Fun, yeah. um, to put the extra work in there. Because uh, um, it's, it also builds uh, the spirit, it builds the, the chemistry, you know, and and, uh, and they understand, you know, it's going to get only more difficult. Now, in the knockout state, you can't make any mistakes. You know, you've got to be sharp 90 minutes or maybe even longer. And I think, you know, if you look at our back, to, uh, our back line, and especially both center backs, you know, how they played this game today was just it's wonderful to see. You know, Michael Oscar is. They're like a rock, and, and, and Clarence with his leadership pushing that line further up, you know, and not dropping deep. That helped uh, a lot in the midfielders, you know, to, to get the balls in, in, in upper areas, and not too deep. It's good. Um, no, it was uh, pretty obvious, you know, starting the game, you know, they had a back five line, um, very compact, you know, didn't allow any space there to go through. Um, that it will end up in a grind, it will end up in a battle, you know, and you gotta kind of win your one against one situations, you gotta um, sooner or later hope that there is an opening moment and then break through and score and score a goal. Um, so we said it at halftime, you know, you gotta be patient there, you gotta keep working there, you gotta you know, shift over to the other side whenever possible. I think Stuart Holden did that very well, you know, with a lot of diagonal balls, you know, taking them over, getting them tired, and they got tired uh, eventually.